Hey fellas, um, welcome yet to another video. This will be one of my repair series, you know, following that trend of graphics card repairs. Um, dealing with a 2070 Super this time. Not very super clean, as you can tell. Um, but we're going to be doing something today that I don't normally post because I just, uh, there's so many of you take it out there doing the same thing but we're gonna be replacing a dead MOSFET today it's this guy right here and uh, you can tell that it is dead just by that right there you see that bump yeah so uh, this thing is RIP there is no shorts I don't have any shorts but obviously if you have a bad face that's gone bad like this the card is not going to work anyway so it's just the face that went bad and the card just doesn't work now another thing that might be going on here is that as soon as I go and try and remove this this chip here we will encounter a case where the chip is actually welded to the board in that case typically man I don't go any further than that I just leave it as it is but if it looks like I can repair it like I can you know put some copper there or make up for pads or whatever I will but depending how bad it is I'll just stop right there and just you know leave it as as is so okay um, let me go ahead and get ready here and get this puppy uh, removed. The thing that I got to mention is that uh, normally when it's this bad, uh, when a, a driver MOSFET looks this bad, I, I tend to want to, you know, I normally grind this stuff down because typically looking at it, just by looking at it, you can tell there's a bulge there, which means there's a pop underneath, which means that there's a high probability that this is welded to the, to the PCB. Uh, but for the sake of the video, the video today, I will share this destructive part of uh, GPU repair. This one is not so, what do you call it, um, so high priority uh, for me, to be honest. Um, you know, it's a 2070 Super, of course, uh, I want to fix it. But I also want to share this kind of content with you guys. So let's go ahead and, uh, yeah, I got the uh, electrolytic capacitors there with some cap tom tape because this will get pretty hot there and it's you know they're relatively close so that i'm not too comfortable with so i have to protect them. but yeah let's go ahead and share this awesome experience together all right let's get into it That actually did not go as bad as I thought beside the, a little fire that that sparked under the card from some lint that's what it looks like under the microscope um, so all the pads are intact everything looks good uh, I'm gonna go ahead and proceed from here uh, and just install this little puppy and hopefully this will get this uh, 2070 super back on the road
Alrighty then, so we got the power stage here replaced. Uh, I still got to clean the card out, but before we do anything else, we need to make sure we have no shorts anywhere. No, okay, that's good. Uh, of course, that's going to be that. That's PEX, we're good. All right. And I think this ought to do it. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and wait for the car to cool down and then we'll uh, cross fingers and take it for a spin. Yes, now we've got the little card installed in the system. I have uh, not, I put that there. I have not tested it, so it's not like I know if, I, if it works or not. If this catches fire or pops, you'll be sharing that with me today. Let's go. Okay, you saw that I did not plug in the card, and yet you didn't tell me. Man, what's up with you guys, man? Jeez. All right, let's try this again. All right, it looks like the screen is coming on. Guys, don't 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 get on my case. You know, I'm 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 an old dog. You know, been around the block for a while, so I forget things. But positive note, the little card is booting. Now, I am very, 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 uh, ooh, like, scared when I first turned these things on with that little cooler because it's a little cooler. But let's load the drivers or let the drivers load and see what our sensors look like. I'm almost in a hurry to turn this thing off because I don't feel comfortable. Okay, so everything's good. Everything's good. Let's turn it off. Off, 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 off you go. Oof. All right. Now we're gonna, the next step is we're going to put it together and run it through some gaming tests, gaming engines, you know, and stress it just to make sure that all, everything is well. So, all right, be right back. And guess what just arrived in the mail? You guys have been asking about this. Uh, I'm not supposed to be making a video about this product, but you know what? We can do a, like a unboxing of it, right? And I know that you guys have been asking and asking and asking about this. So here it is. All right. There you have it. And the things that I do to please you guys. This will be the next video, so stay tuned for it. We'll be uh, comparing it to uh, various thermal pastes or whatever. And also to uh, Thermal Rights Helios. Uh, face changing material. Okay, let's get back to the video. I've concluded that this thing here just looks so hideous, right? I mean, look at the state of this thing. Uh, we will need a shroud, so we this will we'll keep, but I'm gonna share my little stash here with you guys. <laughs> oh man. So, yeah, this is my little stash of coolers. Um, I have. Um, some coolers for that card, I mean, yeah, heat sinks that I have washed thoroughly, like this one here. So instead of using what came there, if this is compatible, we'll be switching to this. So let's see, get this out of the way. Does it look like it'll fit? Yep, I think so. All right, let's do it. Oh, we're giving the... Uh, 2070 super a little bit of love here with some good thermal pads over the VRM. We'll recycle the old pads. There's nothing wrong with them. They're still They look like they're still in good shape All right, let's get this thing put together. All right, and there you have it put back together Actually looks pretty good. I mean, yeah, it's got some cosmetic issues here and there, but um, It looks good. All right, let's put it back in the system and uh, test it with some games Right, guys everything's looking good temperatures are actually very good um, the little card is running like a champ yeah yeah it's an older car you know yeah, I get it but still um, it's running and that's all that matters yeah all right guys I'm gonna leave it here if you haven't subscribed please do so it helps the channel out and I appreciate all of you uh, much love to everyone from Norway you guys take care I'll see you in the next one Bye-bye.